Hi guys, welcome back to the Local Man channel. Today, we're going to show you a simple hack on how to clean headlights. We're going to take this from this to this. We're going to use common household items that are easy to find around in the store or supermarkets. For example, we're going to use a spray bottle, baking powder, sorry, baking soda. We're going to use a toothbrush, toothpaste, dishwasher soap or liquid soap, warm water, and some wipes as well as a microfiber towel. After this water spray bottle, fill it up with dishwasher soap, like that, up to this point here. Then we're going to add in warm water up to a given point here. Then we add in look temp sorry, room temperature water so that it's warm. The reason why we do this is because oily stains or greases tend to get on the headlight parts. As you can see some of them and they need something warm to help it come off. I'll spray the headlight. As you can see, as we spray the headlight, just to get it clean, we wipe it off a bit to make it clean and thorough. Let it come off as we do this. All right, that's step one. Step two, we shall get our baking soda apply in our toothpaste. This is a Colgate Advanced Whitening. It has some grittiness to it and rough texture, as you can feel or you can see. It has a bit, a bit of grittiness. If you zoom in closer or you can see from where you are. So what we shall do, we shall spray some of it in here. Then we'll get some of our warm water, put in a little bit. Wipe this off a bit. Get our toothbrush, mix it all up. And as well as use the same mixture to whiten your teeth. <laughs> That's if you're not afraid of trying out this. Now you can see, look at the rough texture it gives us here. If you zoom in from the mixture of both. So now what we shall do, we shall get this and start applying it on the head. As you scrub it circular motions like this, Keep scrubbing it. Try to get more into the corners here, as you can see here. Keep rubbing it around. We're going to keep distributing this mixture all over the headlights so that we can get it all covered up. Now, it dep depending on the yellowness of your headlight, it will help you know whether to add more or keep applying more and more. What we are going to do, we are going to keep rubbing, rubbing off, moving from spot to spot, take a few seconds per spot, rotate, move the toothbrush in circular motions so that you can get every particle and every inch of the headlight. So we keep moving, rotating our toothbrush as well. As you can see, some of the yellowness is starting to come off. If you zoom in closer here, you see this texture as you rotate. The color, the initial color of our mixture was blue. You see it right there. But look at it on the toothbrush here. You can see a bit of yellow, the yellowness on it. So as we keep rubbing, compare, contrast it. Look at this, look at that. Of course, this is supposed to be a transparent, clean surface. Eh? But this shows you how it's coming to pull off the oxidized particles on the headlight. Huh? The number of times you should scrub the headlight depend on the yellowness of the headlight. It's a temporal solution. It's a simple home hack if you can't afford to use other methods. Though this can save you the trouble of buying new headlights. 
as you know headlights a pair of set goes over a hundred dollars actually about three hundred dollars a pair so now we're done with this we shall put this we shall get rid of this So now we get our spray bottle that has our warm water, we start spraying onto the headlight. As we keep rotating and scrubbing it in circular motions. You can see it coming off. Make sure you try to get the corners and the edges here because some of it tends to get in here. So, we continue to spray our dishwasher soap with warm water mixture. We shall call it the local man, Alexa. If you want to know the secrets here or you missed out on the point in the beginning, it's called the local man recipe. <laughs> Please subscribe, hit the notification button and like. Let's get back to what we're doing. As you can see, it's become cleaner and cleaner. Though I must tell you, this method only applies to plastic headlights. It doesn't apply to glass headlights. Most modern cars these days have plastic headlights. The old in cars of those days had glass headlights. So now we're done with the scrubbing bit. All the toothpaste is off and the baking soda. So we keep spraying our water. So now, we get our microfiber towel and we start to wipe it off. Give it a nice polish. It's important to always get these corners. Now, as you see here, it's quite slim and hard to get into. What you do, you get your microfiber towel, fold it like this, squeeze it in a little bit, like this, and like this. Then take wipe it going to the right side like this to get in there very well on those spots. And now you see, oh, still a little bit here. As well as here. So now, as well as the top here, make sure you don't leave any bit undone. Fix it in a little bit and wipe it down like this. Just the focus. So now, you can see it's much more clearer than the way it was before some paper towel and we've applied on it some polish to give it that shiny gloss look so you buff it up wax it clean rub it off to give that shiny glossy look So there you go, ladies and gentlemen. Take a look at it. This is after, and this is before. If you're new to the channel, kindly subscribe, hit the like button, hit the bell icon to be notified when we release new content. And I hope you enjoyed this. Thank you, have a lovely day.